Okay, whenever you have an exponential equ equation with a base of e or a base of 10, you want to use the natural log or the log to get the exponent, um, the x out of the exponent. So in this example, since the base is e, we want to do the inverse of that, which is the natural log. And we're going to do it to both sides. So that means x plus 2 is equal to the natural log of 127. Okay, because when you take the natural log of an e, um, whatever the exponent is, is going to be all that's left. Now the natural log of 127 is just a number. So I can subtract the 2 from both sides. So this would be the exact answer. If you wanted to know um, a rounded answer, it would just be the natural log of 127 minus 7, so it's approximately negative uh, 2.16. Okay, if you wanted to do the same thing with this one, you want to get the e by itself, so first you have to divide both sides by 6. So we have e to the negative 0 0.4x is equal to 8. Then you take the natural log of both sides. So negative 0 0.4x is equal to the natural log of 8 and divide both sides by negative 0 0.4 so x would exactly equal the natural log of 8 well, the negative natural log of 8 divided by 0 0.4 but if you wanted to approximate that <coughs> you just put it in your calculator so it would be negative 5.2 okay Whenever you have one with a base 10, you instead of using the natural log, you want to do the common log. Okay, so the log of 10 is just 1, so that brings this down. Log of 72. And then we want to subtract 1, so log of 72 minus 1 and then we want to divide by negative 2 so x is equal to the log of 72 minus 1 over negative 2 and if you wanted to approximate that negative point four three. Now you gotta make sure you put the entire numerator in parentheses otherwise if you don't it'll just do log of seventy two uh, plus one half. Okay so negative point four three. 